It just feels so good. It's like um, I'm getting this kind of tingly facial. It really feels good to go bare face. I don't know if you've ever done that. I know some people have their their eyelashes and eyeliner like tattooed on, which I tried to do a long time ago on my lips. <laughs> but I'm completely bare face now, and there's just something about it, you know. You feel completely in your element and, and centered with nature and everything. And here it is at winter, and I feel the cold on me. And I actually really, I really love the briskness. I'm not sure if because of the, the Scandinavian in me, the Viking, but I got my little hoodie on today from California. <laughs> How they were gonna see my baby pants, my comfortable things. I actually got a lot of things done today. I got a whole bunch of chores done and I am so so happy because I hardly ever get anything done <laughs> um, as most of you know I have the fibromyalgia we're still guessing what it was and so many of you have that so you know what it feels like you know when you get something done uh, and it just it feels like this really really great accomplishment <laughs> you know and now here we are, we're definitely, the other day we had, um, ooh, look at that, <laughs> that's definitely going to have to go in, <laughs> it's getting too cold, I had to bring the plants in and everything, but yesterday I think I was out and about and it was like 55 degrees, and um, we went on that walk and Steph and I took you around the yard, and now, because it's going to be Thanksgiving of course, you know, <laughs> it does this every year. Right before Thanksgiving, we get all planned up, all of us, you know, get the car packed up, ready to go. And then the big storms hit and nobody can really go. And so here I thought, it's going to be like 60 degrees, yay! But no. And But I love this. I mean, I just love this. Look at this. Check this out behind me. <laughs> Look at that. I, it's the... The fog is hanging low, the clouds are coming down really low, and it's like really chilly. My fingers are gonna go like white. <laughs> but I love it. I'm saying that now. See how I sound in middle of January? <laughs> I'm still so happy. <laughs> You're like, oh. I don't know. John hates it. I, I can't blame him. I, I hated it for a while because mom died on Christmas Eve. <laughs> but, you know, it takes a long time to get over that. And both his parents, one died at Thanksgiving, I told him, and the other on Christmas. So, <laughs> poor tree. It needs some love. <laughs> and so we don't, we don't like the holidays much. And I'm gonna try to have a sense of humor this year. <laughs> and um, the holidays are tough on all of us. We all get really, really lonely. I think. So, especially if you have chronic disease and you just don't feel like going anywhere and you don't feel like seeing friends or you feel sick that day. So I'm hoping this year will be a lot better and if not, hook up with me, you know. I'll chat with you. <laughs> I know what it's like. I'll chat with you. But anyway, I'm getting a lot done today and um, I'm going to go uh, <laughs> to the secret room here. <laughs> and no lights. Woo! Look at that. I'm actually in the laundry room and it's the rest of it, but <laughs> one time our friend who was staying here, he got to do laundry and this latch here, <laughs> it had to be redone because it, for some reason he couldn't open the door again, so he pushed his little thing on and safety thing. <laughs> Wait, look at this. He was in there, I don't know how many hours <laughs> before we came by. <laughs> So, John made this like safety net so you can always push yourself out. <laughs> I would like to be stuck in a laundry room. It's not real big for claustrophobic. It's like, it looks like a spaceship kind of. <laughs> but anyway, I got a lot going on. Oh, that feels good. Don't you just love to sit on a hot dryer? <laughs> Maybe it's just me, but it's like, ooh. <laughs> but I got that. That's still going good. Bring it out of here. I get stuck. Ah, ah. Oops. Yeah, it pushes back when you have to push it forward, or the cats will get stuck in there. I haven't seen many of the cats lately. One was up here yesterday, but I think it's time to clean their ball. 
<laughs> I am the worst mommy. Got that in there. But, yeah. Here we are approaching winter for the little, the little tree house. And how are you guys doing anyway? Is it getting me cold where you're at? Do you have snow yet? Are you expecting snow? Um, I hear there's stuff come, uh, coming up, some storms. I think it was in the middle area or clear east. I'm not really sure if it's Midwest or east. But it, um, do you have plans for the holidays and all that jazz? Um, are you ready for winter? <laughs> Do you have your wood yet? <laughs> so we're lucky enough to still have some from last year. Hi, Lila! <laughs> Hi, it's good. Are you cold with like that when you had? Why would I be cold? Oh, I love it. Just saying that I actually like it when it gets brisk like this. So you, you're not the biggest fan. Woo! What, what are you doing? <laughs> Join. Oh, okay. <laughs> John can do the splits. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he, he used to do, um, he's on yoga, ballet, doing? but he can do the splits. John, show everybody that you can do the splits. Oh no, he's got his pipes, he's not gonna listen. Here comes Dave too, so. <laughs> oh, you need to knock bottles. <laughs> he's hippies, I tell you. <laughs> oh, it's gonna crack. My hands are numb. I. Which ones did you oh, they're grab? talking. I, I see. I can't hear them. I, I always interrupt people because I can't hear. <laughs> but he can do the splits, and he's now he's going to be embarrassed. You guys, right, in the comment section, you got to do this for me because I don't even know if my comments are work. I never get any. Not even nasty ones. <laughs> they're not even sure it really works. But try to get John to do the splits. The guy's seventy. He hasn't done yoga or taught it for like, um, hi. <laughs> I'm telling everybody on the YouTube that John does the splits. He knows how to get up and do no, <laughs> the splits. splits. He, he hasn't it. done it for any. <laughs> <laughs> Lord, I don't know what he's saying, but he, he'll tell you. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> yeah, he was like yoga boy. He was like yoga man. <laughs> <laughs> woo, woo. <laughs> that is our really, really sweet neighbor, <laughs> Dave, which you know, but, but yeah, he is a, he's, he's seen him do some pretty incredible things, <laughs> but he has not, like, done anything, he won't do anything for like, years, and I just feel to get him to do the splits. I'd do that, and I'd, my vagina would tear. <laughs> Woo, what does he do? What does he want? This is a little beer keg thing here, but... Oh, wow. Is that all your beer in there? That's yeah. the new beer. Oh, cool. Did they bring it back? Bottles? Well, he brought two bottles back, but I don't know where he got them from. Oh, I'm not sure either. Because Question is, do they drink it and do they like it? Cause, cause they do their... Here. I can see his mouth. Maybe they, say, they do their own beer, but yeah. Oh, that is weird. Why did they bring the... They must have had them over there. Yeah, you should ask if they actually had it, if they liked it. Well, it looks like somebody... I don't know who they have over there next door. Um... Who's the guest? Cause they, the two women who used to come with the dog. I was wondering the, about that. Cool. The dog died. Oh, cool. The yeah. Dog right with died. the dog. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Ooh, that's bad. You don't want that on the holiday. I better close the door now. But yeah, they love his beer. But and he's John is going to put up his beer making, his whole system when he signs. I keep trying to talk him into it because right I have it. Okay, you're gonna be back. Hey, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's. But yeah, they got it all cozy warm. I think they just love. But anyway, it's a couple. And they come up a lot. We really, really enjoy them. But uh, the guy Murphy doesn't get along with a lot of dogs. <laughs> we kind of have to keep away. It's unfortunate. But a lot going on here today. It's so much fun, you know, being here. And the wintertime is so much fun for me. But yeah, it's a bummer I can't hear. I really miss talking to people. I used to be so talkative. It's not just my illness, but also my deafness. So I think he's gonna go over. Did he say that? To ask if they even like the beer. So I'm really glad he's got hobbies. I need hobbies. <laughs> I don't do these vlogs enough. Uh, day of my life. This is definitely a day of my life most of the time, but. Um, like I said, my, a lot of my editing software is not working very well. My power 
director. Um, it's mainly because we tried satellite and things like that. That didn't work, so then we did a different hookup. But it takes forever to upload and download things. It's a little bit better, but... And then our drone broke, like on the third flight, we didn't even really get to do anything. Because I was going to have a drone going. I was going to get another camera. And I had emergency teeth to be done. It's all something, isn't it? <laughs> and I know I need a new camera. And then my other camera, my old Canon, um, it needs a new battery, which isn't too bad. It's not too expensive, right, guys? But whew, it is cold. But um, there's so much to see that I want you guys still to see. Um, we've been here about 12 years now, and there's always something new and different going on. It's always so beautiful. So um, I need to get a whole bunch more things so I haven't been doing everything as much. Um, and I really miss it. I miss my Canon camera because I can do like little short movies. Like I did the little leprechaun things up on the hill and my scary stuff, which isn't very scary. <laughs> I'm really kind of poking fun at stuff. I do a lot of black comedy and like spoof. It's not, I, I hope you know that. <laughs> <laughs> my my um, my things have a lot of metaphors to it. They're uh, they have a lot of symbolism. So, and you have to figure out what's going on when I'm doing there. <laughs> um, but yeah, I was just getting into that, and now I'm not able to do it. Boo me! Call the whammy lens. I say that a lot. I love when Bruce Willis says that. It's like our favorite line. <laughs> Call the whammy lens. <laughs> anyway. Uh, if you want me to do a, a vlog on something, let me know down in the comments. I'm so anxious to have some friends. I'm almost desperate to have friends. Nobody talks to me really. Stasha does once in a while, Jacqueline. But I want some more friends from all over. And I do the hashtags and everything. And nobody, nobody makes comments. I don't know how to get an algorithm. It's been about two years, but I would love to get some girlfriends and stuff who swap recipes and what's going on. I live in the most beautiful area, in, you know, in the Northwest. <laughs> There's so much to show, and I don't know. I must not be hitting the algorithm at all. <laughs> I'm doing something wrong. You have to let me know. Because I got fresh sage out here, and I don't know how to make sage tea, really. But I'm going to learn, and I can fix that up. No, uh, I don't know. Maybe it's my hearing thing. But I'm going to keep at it because I really love this. But that's why I haven't been doing it so much. And so I just want you to know I love you guys very, very much. I love my followers. Thank you, new followers. Thank you, everybody on Facebook. Um, I haven't been on that much. But if you've been watching these, I really appreciate it. All my director friends, all my actor friends and actresses, so, an artist, um, and vloggers, of course. But I love you guys, um, and I hope to hear from you soon. Let me know again how your weather is and what your plans are for Thanksgiving. So, say happy birthday to my brother, by the way. It's his birthday tomorrow, so, and he's 59, and um, it's my brother Tom. So, a big happy birthday to my brother Tom. I love you so much. I hope we get up to Seattle again, and we're going to show you our new little toy when we come up though but, and it's not a camera darn it <laughs> anyway still healing from the tooth thing and i'll talk to you guys soon and i brrr, hands are cold.